Yo, hey guys, Ken Perryman here, and I'm back again with another product. It is the Lit Ones video conferencing light, desk light, zoom lighting for computer video conference light. It's a 15 watt uh, webcam light. Basically, uh, it's a all purpose light that will work as a lighting element for your desk. And also you can tilt it up and face it towards you, as you can see right here, and, and shine it on your face when you have those zoom meetings where you just need a bit more light on so, top of you. Let's right? go ahead and get into the box here. We're gonna go ahead and talk about this. And in this box, it is three color adjustment, which means it basically goes from cool to like natural to warm light basically a bluish white to a white and then to kind of a yellowish white. So touch control, really cool. Uh, I will tell you that I've uh, had a lot of experience uh, with lit ones. Uh, they do make really good product. I and very uh, ergonomic and, and very uh, modern esque design, very slim and <clears throat> pretty cool features on their, on their desk lamps. First, let's just go ahead and talk about what we know, what we need to talk about real quick and get this out of the way. It gives you the size of the lamp with the dimensions. And in this case, it is all in millimeters, which is fine. It's easy to convert 25.4 millimeters per inch. Easy enough. Let's go uh, again. 15 watt power DC socket 80. Oh, 84 LEDs. So I was like 84 pieces, 84 LEDs inside this light uh, with a diffuser panel built in. It's DC 24 volt with 0.75 amps. Uh, you guys could read this. I don't need to go through this whole thing. Uh, very cool layout design. It tells you how you can flex this in whatever mode you want to. It has a remote control, which is also very cool. That's uh, one of the things that I liked about their lights is that they have this great touch panel that's built into it. But what I really wanted to see was a nice um, remote control because in my case, my lights are behind my computer and stuff. So I can't really touch the touch panel. So it's nice that you have this. A remote and I'm guessing by the size of it yep there it is there's a little piece here and I'll, sh I'll show it to you here in a little bit uh, it's a little piece that you pull out to activate the battery okay oh that's nice looking I'm telling you they make good looking lamps guys they make really good looking lamps so now looking down here you can see this is the touch panel and it's protected by this control here power plus plus minus memory and also that I'm sure I remember from their features before that's a timer. Then they have this really cool looking LED panel. You know what this reminds me of? Oh yeah, that feels like it reminds me of what I have that's sitting up over here. That's the uh, the Elgato uh, key light. This reminds me of like a, a mini key light. It, it looks really nice. So uh, great back panel here. Uh, very uh, modern, again, sleek design on this thing right here. So let's go ahead and get this all situated. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have to plug it in as it is, uh, and just show you what I got going on. Because of the fact that I've gotta put this somewhere else, we'll show you how it is set up later. I just wanna show you the functions and the remote control. Now, inside this box is your power supply. Simple enough, plug it in, and then plug it in, plug it in. Let's take a look at what the amount of cableage that we have. I'm gonna say it's about six feet. Okay, so let me show this to you. Here's your connection in the back, plug it in. You're ready to go. It's powered up and it's ready to go. And then I am going to show you how well this works. It's powered on. Look at that. Wow. That is really bright. Is that as bright as it goes? No, no, uh-uh. That's as bright as it goes. Oh my God, it gets really bright. That is impressive. I'm not gonna turn it up towards the camera, am I? Yeah, I am a little bit, but yeah, it's pretty darn bright. It just, look at that. It just blacked my box out. <laughs> it just flooded that light, uh, flooded that camera. But again, you have the ability to drop it down. What's also very cool, I didn't realize this, is see the minus sign here? This minus sign means that it is at its lowest setting. Look at the plus. The minus just turned off, and the plus are still basically slightly uh, glowing, but not fully lit until you go ahead and hit that plus button. I believe it's five times, maybe more. And look, now the plus is fully lit. That means that it is done, right? And then you have mode. Oop, I don't want to power it. There's your white, white light. There's your yellow light. And then this is the light in between, which is basically your mix of the, 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 the cool uh, and the warm light together. So, and then lastly, you have timer setting and then you have your power button. Oh, this is cool. It goes slowly off. Oh, I like that. I really do like that. That's really nice. I love the idea of the remote. I love having a remote in the whole process. This is really awesome. I, uh, I am excited to use it. I like the little hole that they got. You can put a little lanyard onto it, make sure that you can hang it somewhere, make sure you don't lose it. But what I love about this light is literally what I'm using it for right now. I can use it to light up my desk. I can also use it to light up the side of my face for a Zoom call, uh, for videos like these. Anything where you're using a video camera 
or a camera or whatever, and you're recording video, you will use something like this to provide good lighting so that you have, um, so you light up good features so it looks high quality. And this lamp, again, Lit Ones has done done a lot of good lights that I've had so far. Uh, so much so I don't know where to put them nowadays because I have so many of them because I like them so much and they do great product and they look very, again, sleek, all metal arm here. Uh, there's a few pieces that are plastic. The light itself is a bit on the plastic side, but it is also very robust. It feels quite strong. And also the, the panels are so well diffused. They remind me, now that I look at it, they do. They remind me of my Elgato Stream Deck uh, product that I have over here and at a much, much higher price point. And does this does very similar to that and in a smaller form factor in a smaller face it's really nice i'm impressed so with all that guys i hope this was helpful for you i really do appreciate your time and i'm out